MicroScan Link is a one-click connectivity tool that enables seamless integration of AutoVision machine vision inspection jobs into any automation system. From a single PLC to a network of machine vision cameras, MicroScan Link establishes the line of communication between AutoVision and the entire factory floor. To demonstrate how easy it is to use MicroScan Link to link machine vision inspection parameters to an outside system such as a PLC, I will run a quick demonstration. I am already connected to a Vision Hawk smart camera running a pre created job to read a 2D barcode, read a string of text characters, and count the number of characters in a different string. It's my goal to link the results of these tools to an outside system such as a PLC. The mechanism in AutoVision that allows me to do this is MicroScan Link. Each of the tools in AutoVision features small links at the right side that represent possible output parameters. If I hover over the links, I can see what data is actually available to be linked. In order to publish these pieces of data to a PLC system, all I need to do is press the link and select where in the PLC they should show up. Right now, the system proposes strings 1 through 4, and all four strings will be available in standard TCP IP or serial interface, in a Profinet IO interface, and in an Ethernet IP interface. I'll go ahead and click on string 1, so the output of my decode tool is now connected to string 1. I can do the exact same thing with the OCR tool. Right now, you can see that string 1 is already taken by the decode tool. So I'll take the next available slot, which is string number 2. For the count tool, I'll take the number of parts and link that value to integer number 1. This is all that is needed to take data from our AutoVision machine vision inspection job and make it available for outside systems. The next step is to provide the machine vision job with set points that can be addressed from the PLC system. This works basically in the same way. The first point I want to set is the match string for my decode tool, so I can input the string of decoded data that is compared to the data that I expect. In order to do this, I'll click on Match String. I'll click on the link, and again, the system proposes which strings to use. So, I will take string 101 for the match string input from the decode tool. I'll do the same thing for the count tool. I'll click on the count tool, and then I'll set a minimum and maximum count for this tool. I'll click on minimum count and select integer 101. Then I'll click maximum count and select integer 102. Now, I have the ability to control the minimum and maximum count from a remote system. This is all that I need to do to provide a set point in my machine vision job for use by external systems. If I click on the MicroScan Link button at the top right, I will open up the Data Navigator. This allows me to see which pieces of information have been linked in my machine vision job. Right now, you can see we have the decoded text, the match string, the output string, the number of parts, the lower count value, and the upper count value. Pieces of information in yellow are set points that I can control from here in AutoVision, the same way I can control them from an external control system. And if I expect a count of 6, I can set both values to 6. The next thing I'll do is click Run. So the inspection job is sent to my smart camera and will begin running from there. If I click Zoom All, we can see the entire picture. So now the inspection is running, and I can open up the Data Navigator again to see what the values are. And if I want to, I can also change set points from here. And now you can see that the decode tool no longer matches.
If I change it to the correct value again, the decode tool successfully matches. This is how easy it is to link machine vision parameters for use by outside systems using the MicroScan Link feature in AutoVision machine vision software.